Martinine Abervalli. I just thought I'd share a science experiment with you. As I can see, loads of you are drawing rainbows to spread hope and to say thanks to the NHS and to all those workers that are working really hard at the moment to protect us and, and help us to stay safe. So I thought I'd show you how to make your own rainbow and actually how to make it grow. So we're gonna do a little science experiment. You can watch the steps and then try it home yourself. To do this experiment, all you will need are some felt tip pens, which are the colors of the rainbow, two containers, similar size, and some kitchen roll. First of all, take your kitchen roll and you're gonna cut it into a rainbow shape. So the way I did this was fold it in half, okay? And then we are gonna cut the top part of the rainbow going around like this curved shape and then the middle section we're going to cut another curve out just like that and there we have our rainbow shape. Okay, step number two what you need to do is get your felt tip pens and you need to colour along the bottom of the rainbow about two centimetres from the edge of the rainbow in all the different rainbow colours, so this is what it should look like. Okay, step three now, you need to fill your containers up with water, not too much, just enough so you can dip the ends of your rainbow into the container. Okay, so just from the tap, normal tap water, The final step is you've got your rainbow all cut out, you've got the ends coloured about two centimetres up from the bottom, okay, each colour of the rainbow. Next step, last step, is to dip it into the water, only slightly dip it into the water, you don't want to submerge the whole thing, okay, so just the tips of your kitchen roll, your coloured kitchen roll, and watch the rainbow grow. So let's have a look. can see the rainbow is growing, we have success. Okay, so now the science part. So the way this works is the water likes to be together. So the molecules of the water gather up together and because the kitchen roll has little holes in it, it's really, really absorbent. So it sucks up the water and because the water wants to stay together, the molecules want to be close together, the water travels up the kitchen roll, taking the ink with it because the ink and the water have mixed together because they're both liquids. So the ink from the pen, the colours that you've coloured in the bottom of your rainbow, travel up through the absorbent kitchen roll to produce your rainbow colours. I wonder how far you can get yours to travel up your kitchen roll. I'd love to see some rainbows using this science method. 